welcome back to our channel guys. Hey. So today I'm gonna be busy working on some of these deck stairs <laughs> that you guys have been telling me need to be fixed for a long time. We've had this plan in the works. Oh yeah. For a long time. We just had temporary stairs here for a while, but I did go get some material to actually make some real stairs. Yes, final stairs. Final stairs, <laughs> ones that are gonna be permanent here. So hopefully I can get that done. You got some projects to do inside the house also. I do, yes. Got a lot of work to get done today, guys. So I say let's get it. Yeah. Alright guys, like I said, so I'm going to be replacing these temporary stairs with some permanent ones. I have all the wood from town, hopefully that I need to make this project work. I've got to take these temporary stairs off and get started on the new ones. While Anthony is outside working on getting those stairs installed, I need to do something inside the house that I've actually been kind of thinking about doing for a little while now. and. I figured now is as good as time as any to get this done. Um, I do want to paint this accent wall here in the house. Like I mentioned, I've been kind of pondering on it for a little while, kind of maybe add a little bit of color and maybe something interesting in our room. And we do have other plans for other things we'd like to do in our room. And I think painting this accent wall is really gonna tie everything in together when it's all said and done. Uh, I'm definitely going to have to tape this wall because not only do we have like the trim and all that good stuff on this wall now, we also have our Mr. Cool on this wall and I don't want to get any paint on the Mr. Cool. Basically anywhere it's not supposed to be but the wall. So I'm definitely gonna have to tape and be extra cautious while I'm painting this wall. I can't get this one screw out. It's just stripped. Got one off. The worst part of painting is over, and that's the taping process. It always takes so much longer, I think, than it actually does to paint the wall. But now that I got all of that taped off and ready to go, I guess it's a good time to start painting, but I think just to make my painting life so much easier today, I think I'm gonna do all the cutting first and then roll it on that way it's smooth sailing, shouldn't have any problems. Hopefully I won't make a big mess while I'm painting. All right, so I have these two by 12s. I'm gonna be making these stringers out of these ones. I'm gonna use this as a template. I could make them, but since I have this as a template, I'm gonna do that. I think it'd be a lot easier just to copy or trace this over than bust out a square and do it all from scratch. T 
10 inch steps just like the other one so should be good Not sure if you guys can tell, but I desperately need to get a new saw blade because this thing is dull. It's taken me like 40 minutes to cut these stringers. This is the last one. And uh, it's been a rough one because this blade is so dull. I actually got to finish this step off with the jigsaw. I couldn't cut it anymore. That saw is just, the blade's done. So I guess I got lucky. This is the last stringer. coat done on this wall definitely gonna need to do two coats because I can see like the brush marks and the actual paint behind the wall so but guys it turned out so good and actually I think it makes this room feel just a little bit more cozier I think even though nothing's like put in this position here's one of uh, our closets right here still got everything pulled out from the wall but like walking in here and just feeling the vibe with this wall painted, it just feels so cozy. Ugh, I love it. I'm gonna go out there and see if Anthony needs a hand while I'm waiting for this first coat to dry and hopefully it will dry very fastly and I can get the second coat on because we need to make sure we get this room back in order before we go to bed tonight. here to see what Anthony's got going on and make sure everything is going good and I see he's already got these stringers cut and man guys they turned out perfect they're they look almost like we bought them so you did an awesome job baby I'm trying yeah I'm not sure it's, it's a rough one in this heat though I'll tell you yeah it is I haven't been out here that long and I can feel it because <laughs> as it is right now guys we cannot get in and out through this back door which Kind of an inconvenience when you gotta walk all the way around to the front <laughs> so i put some notches in these guys and these stringers right here because i'm gonna have a two by four this one actually mounted to this and that's where the stringer is going to sit almost flush with this so a two by six can sit on top um this the first step is going to come out I know a lot of times the first step on stringers is lower, but um, I didn't put a double uh, rim joist on here, so I can't make it any lower than what it is. So we're just going to have to do with it that way, but it'll still look really nice, I think. Um, just that's what I figured I'm going to be doing, so i got to measure some stuff out. Uh, is that board going to be more for like the weight, you think, on the top? Yeah. Yeah. It's so the stringers can sit on sit. something, plus they're gonna, this board's gonna be bolted. 
Yeah, to the... So it holds it in there, so... Okay. Uh, is. in place um, they're not permanent yet uh, we still got to kind of level it out so we got to kind of dig down a little bit not much though I'd say maybe a quarter of an inch or so it's not too bad might be able to just dig a little bit but we're having a real hard time because it is unbelievably miserably hot outside yeah there is uh, no joking around with this heat today <laughs> I thought I was gonna faint Taking a little bit longer than expected, um, but we're miserable. <laughs> yeah, you want to? Oh, yeah. Yeah, it's good now. Level this way and this way, and it's square. I am so hot. I can't. I don't know if I can take too much longer than this. We got them in place and secure for now. I don't think they're going to be moving. And like Anthony said, they are level. They look really nice. But guys, I think we are going to surrender. Uh, Mother Nature right now is kicking our butt. Oh. <laughs> like. Anthony's not, he's... I don't know if you can tell. Yeah. I'm miserable. He looks miserable. Can you guys tell? <sighs> Sweating everywhere. Yeah. It's, it's too hot. It's, it's, I'm, it's, getting, I'm starting to feel sick. Yeah, I'm, we're starting to feel sick and we're kind of like losing momentum here. So yeah. I think we're going to just call it for now, go inside and cool off and literally chill for a little while. Get right back on it in the morning, guys. Yeah, and right back on it. Doing. Yeah. wasting no time this morning in getting these stairs installed and hopefully we can get them completely done today before the heat really sets in because it is going to be another hot day today. So we're going to be putting some pavers down here. We wanted to make sure it was pretty much level yesterday and we got it pretty much level so we kind of know it's possible right here pretty easy. Yeah. Uh, but now that we have some pavers we're going to lay down, I have to dig this out, put the pavers down and then re-level it a little tiny bit. Yeah. That way the wood's not directly on the ground. Yep. Kind of saves it from the rain and different things, so. Yeah. But it's still very early. We want to get started very quickly this morning. Yeah, and we, here we are. Yeah, we're wasting no time today, guys. <laughs> No. <laughs> Our really shovel. Sucks. Yeah, we've only had that thing forever. What a bummer. Not a good way to start the morning. No. <laughs> that's the last one. Yeah, that's the last one. That's all right. Oh, thank goodness we had one. Don't break that one. Well, worst case, I tell Melanie and Gary get. <laughs> I know they got shovels. Yeah, I need another shovel. I built two today. <laughs> Let me see. Let me get down there. By a root. That car is a root. Feed it, Ghost. He wants to play in the dirt. Right, Ghost? He's like, you guys are digging. I want to dig. I want to help.
I kind of make a spot on the table. Yeah. Right? yeah. That's a rock. Yep, and it looks good. Sweet. All right, number one down. Yay. <laughs> Look, guys, it's only like 7 30, 8 o'clock in the morning. And look at me. I'm dying. Sweating. It's so hot already. Already, guys. Well, let's go. Last one. Okay. Well guys, Roxanne's cutting most of the stairs. If you can see behind her, we're not 100% done at all. <laughs> and in typical Roxanne and Anthony fashion, you know what we did? <laughs> we miscalculated how many two by sixes we need for these steps. We're two boards short. Of course, just <laughs> two boards, that's it. But that's okay, because you know why? Roxanne already planned on going to town today. And so when she goes to town, she'll pick two more up I'm gonna continue to work on this stuff anyway. None of these are screwed in. Um, I gotta make the railing still. I gotta do the post in the front. I gotta do a lot of stuff to do. So while she's gone, I can get that other stuff done and we can continue to work. But it is turning out amazing, guys. Take a look. Yeah. It looks really, really, really good. There's the two steps that we missed. <laughs> <laughs> so we, <laughs> yeah. we lined this post up right here with the inside of this um, stringer. That way, when we do a railing, the post is going to be right here on the inside, going to sit on these pavers. I'm going to box these in so they're nice and tight mm -hmm. and then they're going to come up and we'll have, you know, railings coming up and stuff. And I think it's going to look really, really good. Oh yeah, it's going to look great. But she's going to head off to the store guys. I'm going to go get started on this stuff right now and hopefully we can get this done today before it gets too, too hot. I am upset that we forgot those boards because it's like stalling progress, but it's okay. We're going to get it done.
the store, guys, and I ended up getting all of the supplies we are going to need. <laughs> and I'll tell you what, guys, I was gone for a little while and I came back and it's still hot. Nothing's changed, so. <laughs> now guys and it is very very sturdy i don't think these posts are going to be moving nowhere <laughs> no they're, they're solid on the bottom yeah very solid once they get attached to here then they're going to be even more solid so true yeah so looking good it is looking very good it's actually looking like stairs <laughs> yeah. all right guys well we got these posts put in we got all of the steps except for the bottom steps put on because i got to do some work with those i got to cut out where the posts are going to be um, so we're waiting for that one we're not done yet, as you guys see. We still need the railings and stuff, but I'm sorry, it is too hot yeah, outside. Yeah, way worse than yesterday, and I thought yesterday was pretty bad. Yeah, so we looked at the temperature. It's 103, and it feels like 113. We're in the direct sun over here. I can't really work no more. I'm starting to get dizzy and not feeling too well. I need to go relax. Um, Wyatt's gonna be home soon, so I think we're gonna be calling it for today, guys. We will finish this probably tomorrow or the next day. Yeah. But we gotta take a break. Yeah, this project just about killed us. Yeah, yeah this just about killed us. Yeah. These past two days, it's been so hot outside. Yeah. <laughs> um, so we're gonna be calling it, guys. Thanks for being here on this video. We do appreciate you guys. Thanks for being here. And we will catch you all on the next one. Bye. 